Hey guys, welcome. So that fig tree that we were talking about earlier in the week, um, we're going to look a little bit more into that. Um, so in that passage, the fig tree in Luke 13 um, represents Israel, right? We know that. Um, which is in danger of God's judgment if it continues to reject Jesus as the Messiah. And so also if you read the parable, it says the the servant said, Do, don't touch it. I will put it in new soil and give it a year. And then I will cut it. I will cut it down. You know, if it doesn't bear fruit, I will cut it down. So, I mean, there's a lot to look at. A year, a day in heaven's like a thousand years. What does that look like, you know, here on earth? I mean, I know that summer is at the door. I, I'm pretty sure you guys are aware of that. We're told to know the parable of the fig tree. Um, and, and this is spiritual Israel. If they continue to reject Jesus as their Messiah, it will be cut down eventually. This is the parable of the workers in Matthew 20, uh, 1 through 15. It says, um, For the kingdom of heaven is like a landowner who went out early in the morning to hire workers for his vineyard. He agreed to pay them a denarius for the day and sent them into his vineyard. And about thir the third hour, he went out and saw another, you know, others standing in the marketplace doing nothing. You also... Go into my vineyard, he said, and I will pay you whatever is right. And so they went. And he went out about the sixth hour and the ninth hour, and he did the same thing. And about the eleventh hour. Um, so these hours, too, it makes you want to think, what does this mean, you know? Um, he went out and found still others standing around. He says, why have you been standing here all day long doing nothing, he asked. Because no one has hired us, they answered. So he told them, You also go into my vineyard. And evening came, the landover went to the vineyard. He, he said to the foreman, um, Call the workers and pay them their wages, starting with the last one hire, moving on to the first. The workers who were hired about the eleventh hour came and each received a denarius. And so the original workers came and they assumed they would receive more. But each of them also received a denarius. They all received the same wages. On receiving their payment, they began to grumble against the landowner. So we're gonna look into the next, the next video.